Uh, yeah, what I was going to say. So let's have a look at some momentum stuff as well. Quickly scam through some of the shizzle, my nizzle, my nizzle, my nizzle, my nizzle. I'm rapid today. I don't know why I'm so fast. Yeah, so we're oversold actually on the daily. Sorry, this is the hourly scale. Make it on the daily first. Oversold. Hourly. Oversold. Move up, guys. This is this is indicative right now of thinking that we're going to hold this trend line. Move up. Like, hold it. Back to 50, okay? We'll see what happens when we get to 50. This is the zone to get above around here, okay? And then if we get to 50... And then we find resistance and we break this trend line, 45s on the cards. I think actually, if we can't get above this region here, it's it's gonna be around here, okay? Um, if we can't get above, I think it's very likely we're gonna go to 45 on this and just break this trend line. Uh, if we do, guys, like I said at the beginning of the video, if we do get above this region here and hold, next spot is this bit here. Previous high price, we found support on it. That was the initiation of the break. That was the actual, literally where we kind of flushed down and it's the previous high price on the medium term so if we get above this maybe down again if we get above that it's going to be a great sign for coming back up to previous uh previous areas of support and resistance srs okay let's have a look at this as well relative strength is probably gonna be it's just coming it's just bouncing off oversold as well and then let's have a look at the td uh, ttm squeeze on the hourly as well again oversold it's good it's a good sign guys you know at the end of the day so look on the daily TTM squeeze oversold, RSI oversold, stochastic RSI oversold, TDI oversold. So I don't know how much more fucking oversold this market wants to get. Stochastic's way over. Um, TDI's over. So I'd say that we're going to get a move up here to around this region here. Just above 50k probably. If we fail at 50, <clears throat> it's very likely we break this trend line go 45. Uh, and if we get above 50 and we hold and momentum still looks good. We could get a good shot at getting the previous high price out of the way. And if we get above that previous high price, um, that's going to be a good sign that <clears throat> this whole entire thing was just a blip in the radar and a blip on the, on the you know, a fucking fly on the bonnet, whatever you want to call it. And uh, actually, then we could start thinking about uh, Ethereum as well.